Do you know what a resistant negative relative torque is? Yes, sometimes you need to do that. For example, I'm doing the intrusion of upper anterior teeth for closing an anterior open bite. Yes, sometimes you need to do that. To close an anterior open bite by intrusion of upper teeth, both anterior and posterior segments, sometimes you need to do intrusion of anterior using TEDs for that. In this case here, for example, I need to do the control, to control the anterior inclination by means of torque. When you deal with this, when you control the torque, you will end up with a better inclination of anterior teeth, and this is going to make all the difference during smile. So we must understand how to manage the torque and when to apply this in our practice. In this case, doing the intrusion of upper anterior teeth, because we apply the force buckle to the center of resistance of those teeth, we need to do this torque to counteract the tendency of inclination of anterior teeth. Look at this clinical case here, intruding and intruding with the control of anterior segment inclination. So this is a case that is very, very important to understand and to manage the torque. That's it.